All right, Doug, the Cavs had a dramatic come-from-behind win over oh, the Raptors. What dramatic. Did it, what did it show? Okay, three, I'll say it showed that LeBron's not bad. Bold. And, okay, so I'm kidding, but it's a reminder, if anybody needed one, of just how great this guy is, mm-hmm. that he could play such a flawless game. Two, that the Raptors are really good. I mean, people think they're going to be a pushover in the playoffs. I don't think so. And one is that Kevin Love, to me, in that game showed why he will be the difference in this team getting back to the NBA Finals. It it is a reminder. It was nice to see Kevin Love back for a game like that. My answers are similar. Three, it's it's not just that LeBron's good. It's that LeBron still cares. Mm -hmm. They could have thrown in the towel on that game, and they didn't. He didn't. He wanted that, and that matters. Two, I looked up the Raptors against other good teams. I thought maybe they'd be like a fraud, that they're Mm -hmm. beating up bad teams. It's a reminder the Raptors can hang with the best. They're 2-0 and against Houston this year. They're 0-2 against Golden State, but both games were close. They're 2-0 and against Portland. They split with Boston. Their loss was by two points. Mm-hmm. They're right there with everybody, and they're going to be. Number one, the Cavs can survive bad defense. Everybody that game was tweeting, their defense stinks, they're dead, and then they found a way to win. I don't know that the defense is going to get good for the playoffs, but maybe they can win in spite of the defense. Or that it can be just good in spurts, and that's good enough. And that might be good enough. I don't think you're going to get 48 minutes of stellar defense from this team. We haven't all year. But you just got to find a way to win.